two blue bloods of college basketball going at it in the round of 32. Yes, it's a tight turnaround for the Jayhawks, but they're saying that they feel pretty good after that game against Sanford, and they know this is going to be the most physical game that they play all year, but they're ready for that dogfight. Two great programs going at each other uh, tomorrow, going at each other tomorrow, and you know, it's going to be a physical game, but you know, we got we to gotta worry about us. They're going to bring it, we're going to bring it, so it's just, it's going to be a very fun matchup though. Um, just. They're just a big, big household name. Gonzaga is a, a really great school to play basketball at, so just playing them, and um, it kind of feels like we're playing a little bit away, so it, it feels good to be um, the opposing team this time. It's going to be a whole new game. Um, you know, it, it's going to be like a whole new offense, whole new defense. It's going to be, um, yeah, I mean, it's going to be, I'm excited, like, to be able to play back up from what we played the other night against Sanford to a whole new play style. It should be, should be a good experience. The Jayhawks say having this kind of matchup this early will help them. The Zags agree too, and they know what they're getting in KU. You know, they got big guys that could that could score around the rim. They got guards that could make plays. They got guards that could shoot, and they're, they're a very unselfish team. I think they're number one in the country at assists per game right now. So um, they're just a good team, a great program, great coaches, and uh, it'll definitely be a battle. Their history, man, just their history itself, um, you know, what they what they go by, what their standard is, you know, um, that's what KU's about. Um, so, you know, we just got to play our game, you know, um, go with the game plan, and, uh, yeah, hopefully we get, we get, you know, get on KU the way we want to for sure. 17 straight round one wins for KU, and now the Jayhawks and the Zags will tip off on Saturday right here on WIBW at 2.15. Reporting here at the Delta Center, Ovid's Lover Gene, 13 Sports.